doing a wee haul it and I want to park my toiletries and we're just doing carry on this year um we're going skiing but I'm not going to actually ski because I tried skiing last year and it was the worst experience of my life so I'm not doing that again and I'm just gonna go have a relaxing week and bring some books with me do a bit of reading but I want to go through what I'm bringing with me with you so let me empty this all out okay. so this is just the bag I'm using for the moment because I know when we get to the airport I'll have to use one of their 100 mil bags because I think that's still a thing so this is just one from the Boots Beauty Heroes yeah and I think it's just a really nice travel bag it's clear so you can see what's in it so I'm gonna put that in there the most important thing I'm bringing sun cream this is the Garnier Amber Solaire UV Super Liquid Factor 50 this is my favourite it is now 15 euro though so it's getting docked marks but I've bought this numerous times and I think it's one of the best sun creams that you can get for reasonable price affordability is subjective but a reasonable price next I have my wee travel tub of E45 I think that's very self explanatory E45 <laughs> moisturiser do the body and all I want to sample I have a lot of samples that I'm bringing with me for my skincare routine. So the first one I have is this, I don't support CeraVe because it's not cruelty free, but um, I have this little sample that when I was buying my shampoo and conditioner in a chemist, she was like, you look dry. And she just, <laughs> she gave me like two of these, but I used one of them up on another holiday. So. I have this and this has five mils product so I'd say I used that up really quickly especially since I'm bringing the skincare for both for my fiance and I so it'll be gone very quickly let's just say that and then I have ooh, bougie Guerlain Paris samples this is from their the collection that they have infused with bees and honey and that kind of thing so I have the day cream in this little sachet which I think will be used up very quickly because I want to get these samples out of my life first so and then we have the renew and repair advanced serum sachet I'd say that's about 0.6 of a milliliter so one use that'll be great for the first day when the skin's a bit drier getting used to the cold weather and then this is a fortifying lotion it's a face toner which I think this is a good generous amount and when I use this up this will be a great bottle I wonder if it can be refilled oh yeah that can be refilled really easily so that'll be a great bottle to refill and bring so there it is Fortifying lotion with royal jelly and then we have this I'm going to take this out of the box but this is the advanced youth watery oil it replumps smooths 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 and illuminates and that's what the little jar looks like there it has little like micro beads I hope they're like royal jelly or something that like break up on your skin but yeah we have that and it's a glass container so maybe I sh no it'll be fine it'll be fine I just don't need the excess of the cardboard box and I got those, all those girl on things free when I bought a girl on perfume for myself for Christmas and it was the most expensive perfume but Oh, it matter. This is like bordering skincare, bordering makeup, but I'm gonna take my Dior Lip Glow Lip Balm, Lip Reviver Balm. It's just an easy balm, it makes your lips look pinker. It'll be really simple makeup looks for the week. So that's it, the Dior Lip Balm. Then for base, I'm gonna bring my little travel size of the Charlotte Tilbury Flawless Filter, which I hear people, it takes them ages to even finish the travel size, so that's great. 
because I have this travel size so I don't have to take my big filter finish and this one's lighter anyway so that's great then for cream complexion I'm gonna bring my two Glossier concealers I'm gonna bring G12 which is a eye brightener shade for me and then I'm gonna bring G11 which literally matches my skin tone so that'll be fun and I'm wearing them together today to see what it'll look like and I love the kind of youth like the glow it's giving me like just rediscovered how much I love the Glossier concealer as my base like I used to use G11 as my foundation for ages I'm gonna bring my Glossier Cloud paint as my cream blush just to use it up get it out of my life same old jazz as always but I think if I lost this in Bulgaria I wouldn't mind at all <laughs> then I'm bringing the little travel size Charlotte oh you can see yourself wee -hee. the little travel size Charlotte Tilbury powder in fair because I am fair <laughs> for a kind of a blush bronzy duo I'm taking this Too Faced Love Flush watercolour blush in California Love and this is just literally such a neutral like it is a neutral shade so I think it'd be great hybrid of blush bronzer to one stone then for a highlighter I'm bringing the collection gorgeous glow stick in the number two highlight this is my project pan for the year and I think I'll get some use out of it in Bulgaria for eyebrows I'm taking the Glossier Boy Bright this is on its last legs it is on its last legs so that's why I want to bring it to Bulgaria so I can get the use out of it and then another little free sample I'm bringing is the Charlotte Tilbury Pillow Talk Push Up Lashes such a small mascara I'm not gonna open it right now because once I open it you know I want it nice and fresh for when I'm in Bulgaria hence it's a little lovely little thing and that's all that I'm bringing makeup wise and skincare wise so I think this is gonna be a great minimalist makeup week anyway that's all for my video uh, I would love recommendations of oh don't look my nails I'd love recommendations of what you bring when you go on holidays like makeup wise skincare wise I don't want to bring everything just in case stuff gets lost but then I don't want to go with too little because then I don't want my skin to be like what the I don't want my skin to be like what the hell is happening I'm not used to this what is going on but yeah let me know <laughs> I'll talk to you next time bye